Hi, my name is Paul and this is Harold. Harold is 50 years old and in 1985 sustained a uh, spinal cord injury of uh, C5, C6. I was placed in a halo and managed at this time. Uh, sees us today for back pain, but I thought you'd find it interesting to see some of the neurologic signs and symptoms that come with a spinal cord injury. Um, one thing I've noticed today is that he has a very positive Hoffman sign. This finger was injured in the accident, but you can still do a Hoffman test by uh, holding uh, the distal part of the finger and flicking uh, the end of this finger and you're going to notice the approximation of the thumb and forefinger when that happens. The very positive Hoffman's test. Um, the other thing that uh, we find is he's super hyper reflexive and you'll notice that he continues to go into a little clonus on both sides. Dorsiflex him quickly clonus will continue and he also has a positive Babinski test there was a splaying of the toes and the extension of the, the big toe all positive of neurologic compromise uh, so if you see this in a patient who comes in who may not have had an injury uh, you need to be thinking of uh, something in the central nervous system uh, and upper motor neuron type lesions thank you